have modeled and painted places for themselves in the mass media. Done very well, too. Wayne Falagowski tonight found a young artist who wants to make this Portland art connection a trio. Chris Parrott of Beaverton High School knows he has talent, and he's not bashful pursuing his dream of becoming a well-known artist. Parrott has parlayed his artistic talent into a $50,000 four-year scholarship at New York's prestigious Pratt Art Institute. It has been uh, a dream of mine. I heard about it about three years ago at, one, at a college fair here in Portland. Parrott is one of only six students in the country to win a scholarship to Pratt. For the past two months, he's worked on a giant-sized self-portrait that he'll take back to New York next month for an award ceremony. He'll also exhibit a number of drawings that highlight his obvious talents. His high school instructor says many art scholarships are available, but it's up to the student to get the ball rolling. I have a lot of um, uh, representatives from the different art schools come in and talk to the advanced art classes. So they start getting an idea that there are a lot of options out there for them. You would think, with all the notoriety that Portland's Matt Gronick has received as creator of The Simpsons, with all its instant wealth, that students like Chris Parrott would aspire to be the next Matt Gronick. But that's not necessarily true. Probably my biggest idol is uh, Picasso. Uh, from, a, from an early age, he exhibited a lot of uh, classical artistic skill. And from there, he was able to continually progress as he got older. What if you have a child with artistic talent? You cannot deny it. I mean, you have to act on it. And if you deny it, uh, then I think you become an unhappy person. Parrot doesn't wear rose-colored glasses. He's heard the term starving artists, but he's willing to pay the price. There's not much money in, in the profession, but it, it's really what I want to do. Judging by his talents, he shouldn't starve for long. In Beaverton, Wayne Falagowski, Newsroom 6. Oh, we'll be hearing from him. He's better than Picasso.